Let's take a look how the Pino FBT on Windows looks like. Uh, let's bind the trackers with our joints. Okay, so now simple to do. Side kit, forward kit, uh, backward kit, turning 36 degree. Okay. People concerned about like lay down, lay down easily. You can rotate yourself. All right. The other side. Quite easy. Any kind of motion. Simple to do it. Or you can. Check your hip very easily. Turning around, pretty cool. To use Pino FBT on Windows, you will need a, a Windows PC, uh, a webcam. Um, you can use the built-in camera on your laptop, or you can use a, a external camera from outside, or you can use your iPhone as a webcam, but you need a, like, like uh, IV cam, this kind of app to uh, to connect your iPhone to the PC. Android is the same. Uh, you can use the uh, webcam, my, the camera on Android as the webcam. Now you go to Microsoft Store and Check it out the uh, Pino FBT and install it. So now, once you mm. install this, and you can start it, just launch the app. So now you have the uh, Pino FBT. Uh, then you can see there are three kind of platforms. Uh, Pino Quest is for VR chat and Death Dash. Pino Soft is for Steam VR game like Brain Sorcery. Uh, Pino Copilot is to use as a dual tracking. It's the secondary app for dual tracking. Now we check out the single tracking. You you only need a, uh, a single camera to use single tracking. And before you check out this uh, this app, you have to connect the webcam first. So let me connect this webcam and let's start it. So you have to connect before start the app. And let's check out Pino Quest. Okay, Pino Quest, you choose single device if you use only single camera. And there is a Quest PCIP. Uh, you can type, you have to check out the uh, IP from your headset. How to find out your Wi-Fi? You have you can click the corner and go to Wi-Fi. Check out this. Uh, uh, there are a bunch of informations here, and you will see IP address. This is your headset IP. All right, check out this and input into the pin FPT. For example, uh, my headset IP is this. Uh, okay. And check out your height. You can input it as metric. For me, it's 175 centimeter. Or you can type like uh, five, five, uh, five feet, 10 inch.
and check out basically there are two types of set, uh, game now uh, if we want to use VR chat just check VR chat and connect link and you ask if you, you want to use the camera just say yes okay here you go you see it's tracking my it's tracking me now all right and you can switch the camera by clicking this camera this is for every cam but i i haven't connected with my iphone so it's empty uh, the other thing is uh okay of course you can use the default camera okay this is mine so but because it because I prefer use it as a like a, as a portrait. If you use it as portrait, you have to rotate this uh, angle to make sure this kind of direction is the same as your sky or your city. It must turn toward to the city. All right. And you start tracking you now. So next, uh, you just jump in the game. Once you get into VRChat, you can find a mirror. Click it. now. Click the option. Check out the OSC. Make sure you enable your OSC function and go to Calibre BT. So now you got this check-in. Alright. Uh, if you want to turn on this, you can go to the setting and turn it around, turn it on. Uh, this and for the free version, you only have upper body. If you want to use a whole body, you need a, a subscription or use the trial. We have seven days trial. Alright. Now it start working. If you need to use the uh, chat on PC, here you have to enter the PC IP, not the Quest IP. And the other thing you have to do is here is a subscription and uh, you should download this Windows patch and that would allow the Windows uh, send all the signal to itself. So this patch is required. You have to download it and it will say download anyway. Okay, once it's download, to download to the desktop. Once you download it, you just uh, you just open this folder and right click, run it as administrator. There's a more info, and here you just run it. And you complete the running, your is all set. And in this subscri subscription page, there is a trial item. You can use it uh, for one week to try this app. And we have several, we have two platforms, or you want to subscribe both. You can choose which one you need. And if you want to subscribe it, just click on it. Uh, but you have to wait uh, a few seconds uh, due to Microsoft Store is quite slow. Okay, so here is the uh, payment. An important thing I have to mention here, Microsoft does not support any refund. So you must be cautious of 
any subscription before purchase make sure you understand the functions of this app and it satisfy your requirement so uh, make sure uh, you understand it will not be refund if you regret any purchase next let's talk about PinoSoft PinoSoft has the same uh, configuration uh, you need to input the same information as PinoQuest however uh, because it connects to SteamVR you need to download the VMT first you have to come to this virtual motion tracker in a github all right and there is a, a text so now you need to download 12 version 0 0.12 not any other version just make sure you download this version and unzip this you will get this uh, folder and oh before you install the vmt you have to make sure your steam is connecting so make sure you have steam vr launched and connect to your headset so now click click vmt manager open this software and click install and you will say okay please restart steam vr so just okay and let's restart the steam vr restart steam vr okay so once you restart it you finish this uh, installation of vmt so your steam vr can connect with uh, pinosoft the last part let's talk about um, dual tracking if you choose uh, if you want to use dual tracking you require two cameras uh, so the other camera it could be from the other webcam connect to your PC or um, it could be the Pino Copilot uh, you can run Pino Copilot on your iPhone or Android, you can use them as the second camera. So let's see if you want to use two webcams, you need to download the Pino Copilot. Uh, if you click the download, it will, it will get you to this page. And you just click Get, uh, open Microsoft Store, it will bring you to this page. You bring you to the Pino Copilot. I I have downloaded it, so I just start the game, and you will get you will get you to the Pino Copilot. This is for the second camera. Now you have Pino Copilot, and get into Pino Copilot. You need to uh, enter the Pino FBTI TIP which is the here basically it's the uh, I, the PC's IP your PC's IP so just put the IP here and click link okay and it start working so this is your second uh, this is the second one the second camera and the other the other app has the uh, uh, first camera, so you can have dual tracking. And make sure the copilot is blinking, it means the connection successfully.